Hi, welcome back again. Um, in a previous video, I talk about find and replace, and I told you that I don't know what is regular expressions, and I make some research on this, and uh, this is a result I want to share with you. So, in order to do this, I want to tell you some info about. So we have a text here and we want to make some search uh, in it. Let's uh, make a simple example first. Uh, for example, I am searching for A, B, C, for A or B or C. I'm, I have no text like A, B, C in this uh, bottom text, but I want to find the A and B and C spread in this document. So I check regular expression in parentheses I am entering A, B and C. And let's check now. You can see I have a A, B, C, A, B, A, B and so on. So it's very useful. Let's um, check for more information because you can see it's very useful in some situation. To go there, you go to edit, find or replace, and you get this window. So let's try edit, find or replace, and let's move a little bit down here. And let's uh, make some um, search in this text. Let's go further. We have a list of characters to use for search, for example, if I want to search for a dog, but uh, for words beginning with D, ending with G, but any character between, we place a dot between. And we have this dot, and you can see we have dog and dig also. If I am uh, removing the dot, and I am putting dog, of course this will disappear because dig is not dog. Let's uh, make a, another example. Uh, let's search for dog beginning at the beginning of a paragraph. We enter this symbol and we can find when a paragraph is starting with dog. It's just one. It's one um, Let's search for dog in the end of the sent uh, paragraph. Uh, dog with point because uh, we have uh, dots at the end of the sentence, and we have here. Let's check for another example. Uh, we can search, for example, for. Um, tabs uh, this represents a tab let's search how many tabs we have in this document so we have one tab let's insert another one and let's find we have two tabs here you can see it's very easy to see let's make another example we want to know with this symbol uh, how many words begin are beginning with this uh, with dog for example find all one two three four and five if I'm having here for example a word containing dog but not in the beginning let's insert a sentence I am not a bulldog and search again is not finding because dog eats a word but it's not in the start of the word so very useful like i said before when we searching like this it's searching for words in the brackets so let's search for example w we have w we have these three words, uh, these three words. 
and now we are searching for 1 to 9 7 to 9 and so on so it's very useful to make search on numbers on letters and so on you can see now I'm searching for 1 and 2 very easy 1 to 3 and so on is not so hard to use if we want um, between A and B and also between T and W we writing like this and you can see everything is like we entered we wanted and you can see here a lot of other symbols and useful queries uh, in order to find more you can go to help LibreOffice and here you have writer and write regular expression and if you click here you can see this and a list this list I explain you about this you can see it's more more info here and also a regular expression documentation here uh, I hope you like this uh, tutorial today please subscribe for more videos and uh, like this thank you